Now, forewarn weather with Exact Track 4D radar. Exclusive technology for the most up to the minute weather information in your neighborhood. All right, looks like we are headed into a really gorgeous weekend. A Friday in the summer that's like this, I mean, there's nothing to complain right? about, right? I, well, unless you have to work. No. <laughs> but for those that True. don't, uh, <laughs> you know, outside, grilling outside, yeah. just even just eating outside on your patio, these days, just, you know, we don't get enough of them here in Southeast Lower Michigan, so we do enjoy each and every one of them. 79 right now, live look at the Ann Arbor Art Fair, 78 degrees there, 75 in Howland, 77 in Port Huron. For tomorrow, the last day of the fair, it's a perfect day to get there. Temperatures will be a little warmer than today, but starts out cool. So if you get out there early in the morning, you don't like that hot weather. It's definitely a good time to get out between about eight and noon and then four o'clock. Mostly cloudy skies with some sun and 84 degrees, partly cloudy at eight o'clock and right around 80. You'll notice a little bit more humidity tomorrow, but still very tolerable and comfortable. Just a typical summer day. 76 now in Pontiac, upper 70s in Lapeer, 77 in Port Huron and 78 in Ann Arbor. Pool planner, another thing that you need to kind of plan for because we don't get a lot of days you can be at the pool either, especially on a weekend, but it looks like we're going to be just fine for tomorrow with a lot of sunshine. Flood warning, though, is still in effect for the Huron River near Hamburg, so levels are still high, and you need to be careful if you're in this area. If you do live near the Huron River at Hamburg, just know that this continues until at least the end of the weekend and possibly even beyond that. Right now on the satellite and radar, a big ridge of high pressure giving us nice, stable air. There are some showers and storms way out to the west, moving just to the northwest of Omaha, but not going to affect us here in Metro Detroit. In fact, our next chance for rain is not until at least Tuesday. Tuesday morning, 8 a.m., showers just along the Ohio border, and then as we go throughout the day on Tuesday into the afternoon, a couple showers, maybe a thunderstorm pops up. And then we'll continue to have the rain through about midnight, overnight. Uh, it'll continue even until the morning commute on Wednesday. And then Wednesday afternoon, another shot, probably a better shot at some heavier rain in the afternoon and in the evening. And that will continue into Thursday. But until then, a nice long stretch of dry weather. Your forecast for tonight, a couple of degrees warmer than last night, but still tolerable. Good sleeping weather, mainly clear skies and winds will be calm. Then for the day tomorrow, this is right where we should be for this time of year. 84 degrees is our normal high. We'll have partly cloudy skies and winds will be out of the west right around five miles per hour. If you have something you'd like to get done outside and you need dry weather, I would do it this weekend because you get several days in a row with nice, dry and warm weather. The 100th anniversary of the Port Huron to Mackinac race starts tomorrow. And and finally, this year, it looks like they're going to have really good weather for it. But I've already got a lot of sailors saying, right. what are the winds? What are the winds? What are the winds? Because yeah. that's really all they care about. That's true. That's fun. All right. Thanks, yeah. Kim.